Tomorrow at 7. And now, here are the very newest shiny, circle-y things that play movies. Welcome back, film expert, Chris Gore. Thank you. What are you doing? I, you just switched your ankle? I spent a lot of time sitting down for this job, and uh -huh. uh, it's an occupational hazard, but here I am to present DVDs to you. Okay. I sit down right. a lot is what I'm saying. All right, is that why you were twisting your ankle? I was twisting my ankle, yes. Okay, cool, got it, all right. What's yeah. the first? First we have The Hunger Games. Now this was one of the biggest films of the year and the first part of the trilogy. What did you think? I, I am in the camp that loved this movie. I was really pleasantly surprised. Mm -hmm. um, I, Jennifer Lawrence is also amazing. She really makes this whole thing. Yeah. Uh, and it, they also, I love the fact that they take the subject matter very seriously, which really uh, I happen to love in science fiction. Mm -hmm. You've got to take it seriously. And they handle the deaths of, because really you're dealing with kids killing other kids. They yeah. take that, take it very seriously, uh, and and I, I love that aspect. Plus the fact that like- What do you mean like, they take it very seriously? Like they're because, not laughing? What well, they're mean? not laughing, exactly. And like there's even scenes like, for example, this scene where you see some of the characters get killed, there's no music underneath. So they play it with a level of seriousness okay. that you know the subject matters dark, this isn't mm -hmm. a comic book, right? Yeah. This isn't the Avengers. So um, I happen to really enjoy it. I mean, uh, this dystopian view of the future. And also, Jennifer Lawrence really holds it together for me. I mean, She's Kristen, a great actress. Yeah, uh, Kristen Stewart, uh, they've compared this yeah. series to Twilight. Kristen Stewart, <laughs> God love her. Uh, Jen Jennifer Lawrence can actually act with her mouth yes. closed. Ooh. I <laughs> love that aspect of her. She's All right. amazing. How are the special features? They are abundant. There's a lot of special features okay. on this. But you really, I was a little disappointed in the special features because if you just watch them, you'd think, everybody got along and we hugged all day. <laughs> What's wrong and, with that? Yeah, and That's I, what happens on every film. But after you hear that for the 60th time, I'm going like, come on, just talk about the meat of the story. Okay. Yeah, so I was a little disappointed with the special features, but great movie. Okay, bottom line? Rent it. All right. Get rented, definitely see it. Done, done, done. What's our cool. next DVD? Dexter, complete sixth season. Dexter, what is America's favorite serial killer up to this season? Uh, well, he's battling another team of serial killers, uh, played by Edward James Olmos and Colin Hanks. Mm -hmm. And uh, th there's sort of these sort of dark uh, religious undertones to this. I mean, there's a Judgment Day theme because yeah, uh, yeah uh, all very the, dark, very dark season. Really dark I mean, it is season. Dexter, but... um, so yes, of course, you come <laughs> to expect that a guy who kills uh, and, and kills for fun, uh -huh. sometimes for fun. Um, but I really I like this season. I actually. I I too. really enjoyed it. Um, the, I, the problem I have, I actually have a problem. I, I heard you have a problem. I have a problem Tell with this. Tell me about it. The problem I had was the drinking game that I would play every time I would watch every episode, which was, let's find out when Colin Hanks can smell a fart, which is <laughs> his expression, if you just look at his face, <laughs> Colin Hanks, in, and this is every episode, he did it about seven times, he just, <laughs> Colin Hanks smells a fart. There's a meme. <laughs> There's, a, the one there's a meme there. It's that, uh, and there it is. Wait, he's smelling a fart. It, oh, that's really it funny. Was, it was this ongoing thread in every episode. That was that was his sort of his acting. So you should get together with Kristen Stewart. They could trade acting tips. He's a good actor. I he might have smelled a couple toots, but he is a good actor. Yeah, I actually, I do like him as an actor. I yeah. just feel like he was going one note with the dark, is okay. the nose upturned. And one eyebrow. Yeah, yeah, one All eyebrow. All right, what's the, what's the bottom line? Uh, bottom line is, uh, it's a pass because... Ah, no! Wait, listen, there Negative. are no extras on this, and... Showtime, you gotta learn. Look, Game of Thrones, True Blood, there's tons of extras Whoa, on it. Whoa! We just lost lights. Whoa, that's crazy. Are we still live? We are still live! Yay! Yay! Yay. <laughs> that was... So, bottom line is pass. USA! USA! All right, um, what's the next movie? We gotta go, we gotta keep going. We gotta keep going here. Okay, so, uh, Jaws. Let's talk about Jaws. Jaws. Now, do you think Jaws is this scary now as it was when it came out over 40 years ago? Yeah, no, it's, I mean, look, ago? how many people watched that movie and decided, I'm never gonna swim in the ocean? Um, I did. I'm one of those people, but it's an easy decision for me because I'm an indoor kid already. Mm -hmm. So that, like, I'm a grown-up indoor kid. But this but I this was just swimming with sharks last I, week. I, I, I heard about uh, that. Stupid. I heard stupid. about that. Uh, so what new special features are on the disc? Um, there's uh, uh, this uh, documentary about this convention. There actually uh -huh. was a Jaws convention on Amityville Beach, which is where they actually shot it. Oh, okay. Which I never even knew. I, I've been to all kinds of conventions, never been to that one. Um, and a whole bunch of extras where I feel like I learn something every time they release this on DVD. There's some new fact. Like, for example, the poster, you know, that iconic image of the shark on the poster? 
poster. Yeah. The reason it looks like that is the guy who was the artist was only able to photograph a shark from sideways. Oh my so gosh. he so that was his photo reference, so he made the poster based on that. That's awesome. Pretty okay. weird. Bottom line. Bottom line is buy it. All right. I've been looking forward to this. Buy it. Yes. Thank Love you, it. Chris. Thank you. For more guard, check out his podcast podcast show live at IO West in Hollywood this Saturday night. Ooh.